What up, folks? I am Ultrazilla, and this is my haul of the week plus one. Uh, I'm here with... Ultrazilla Jr. <laughs> That's right. Um, because the first thing we're going to talk about is that plus one, because this was my only item that I picked up last week. Well, not this, but last weekend... Two weekends ago, actually, um, we went to the Tamashi Nation's pop-up shop in NYC. And this is a sticker from the show. Do you remember that, bud? We went to the, the shop with the Godzilla, big yeah, Godzilla. I that. Did you like it? Yes. What, what did you like about it? Um, I don't know. I just like it. It was cool. There was a lot of stuff, right? They had a lot of cool stuff. Um, so we got a sticker from there. Just showing you what we got there, and uh, we got this like, I don't know, lanyard, I guess, uh, with the Tamashi logo. Mm. Yeah. Uh, and then this book, Tamashi Nation's Handbook 2021 Spring, which I haven't even looked at, so figured might as well look at it here. We got, uh, like all the toys? Yeah, so you got, you know, Dragon Ball, we got Goku over here, you got a Gundam, um... Gundam Universe. We got the upcoming Pac Man and a. You got that Pac Man? No, I didn't. It's not. Not that? Yeah. Comes out in May, oh, I, I believe. Got, wait, you got a different Pac Man. Do I? Yeah, you bought one. You sure about that? We got the Pac Man game. And you bought the, the robot Pac Man? The robot Pac Man? When he was a robot. Don't you remember? You said it. Oh, I didn't buy it yet. It's not out yet. The Chogokin, he's talking about. Um, oh. And uh, this figure arts guy, but I don't know who this character is. If you guys know, let me know down below. We might find out in here. But yeah, starting off with some Dragon Ball stuff. Um, this is cooler. This figure is huge. Remember this guy from the show? No. He was like really big. He was like right when we first walked in. Um, oh, and here's all the Pac Man stuff they got going. This is the figure arts. Uh, Wait, um, you got, uh, you were gonna get some of these guys. I'm getting all of these. Um, this one I have on pre-order from HLJ. And, uh, the pro, uh, the Proplica, uh, the Waka Waka Pac-Man. Um, uh, it makes sound effects and it moves. Um, and the die-cast metal Chogokin Pac-Man. Uh, I'm getting, um, these two... From, oh, okay, so this one is June, but that might be here. Uh, and then this one says July, and this one says September. These guys I'm getting um, from Muteki Sales. So, but I will be getting them. Uh, our pal Ray, his wait, shop. Wait, wait, I, I don't remember what I don't know what you're talking about. Ray. Oh, yeah, I remember. Of course you did. <laughs> Uh, and then you got some Demon Slayer, Figure Arts Mini stuff, uh, and this guy, here it is, Jujutsu Kaizen, I don't know this, is this from Demon Slayer as well, or is this is his own thing, I actually, I think this is his own thing, yeah, maybe, right, because it seems like it's got his own logo, so I don't know this, uh, at all, oh, look at his hand, you see his hand? Got like a tongue coming out of his hand. Um, that's crazy. Uh, and then Gundam Universe stuff. This is the wave that's coming out soon. Uh, I am getting these at some point. I still have and lots Godzilla to review. King Kong and yeah, and these we saw. Like, I don't know if they had these on display. Maybe I missed it. Maybe. At the show. Um, Kong and Godzilla. Looking good. You can check out my review. Not really review, my thoughts on Kong. I did a live stream the other night. Uh, you can check that out. Did you like Kong? In Godzilla vs. Kong? I don't remember that that good. What? We just watched it. Um, no, the movie, the movie. I don't remember that that good. Alright, so we've got to watch it again, I guess. <laughs> um, more stuff. Dr. Stone stuff. And Sailor Moon. And uh, here's the back. And there you go. So, Wait, very cool little booklet. Yeah, stuff? that's everything that's in the booklet. And the one thing I did buy, and you know, this is why we're here, Hall of the Week, is the Soul of Chogokin Edeon full action. Uh, so this is GX92. And uh, I was glad to have full gotten action? this. Yeah, that means it's not, it doesn't combine this one. 
Uh, you know how like a lot of these robots combine? This guy ha is usually like, you know, has pieces that transform or combine too. But this guy is just, f just action, just for action. Um, so. Like, a, like attack bad guys and stuff? No, well, no, like, yeah, he's a whole attack bad guys. <laughs> but like, you know, he's just an action figure. Like he doesn't come apart is what I'm saying, so. Wait. What's the thing, like, down there, something coming out of his arm? Yeah, like, missiles that, like, shoot out. Or, like, fire? Uh, I think they're, like, some sort of projectile weapon. And then he's got this big thing. I would like to check this out. So let's give it a quick open just to see how it looks like inside. So I've been waiting to do one of these. And, yeah, I didn't do a live stream because I already did the live stream this week. And I didn't want to do another one. And I got things going on. Uh, that I gotta do, so tonight, like shopping. <laughs> oh, it looks really good, right? Yes, it looks smaller than I expected. To be. Yeah, it's a big box, but you know, the, the rest is just like all the accessories and stuff. That's how they pack these. Um, but the figures aren't like huge, so I do want to look at this. Yeah. So I'm excited. Um, right now, GX96 has just gone up for pre order, and that is. Getter, the ne uh, the next one of these, but it's more of a combining one. Um, GX96 Getter Robo Go. I know what you're talking about. It's, it's another robot, uh, but I won't be getting that, guys. Um, just not, you know, cool. interesting, interested in it. Now, if they did get a Robo Go in this line, I'd probably get it because this is cheaper and um, just more my speed. This is awesome looking. I really like this. I said it was cool. Like, right? Before. Yeah. It's looking cool. So I gotta, I gotta mess around with it a little bit. But I'm liking what I'm seeing so far. Yeah. I like it. I like it. Don't know when I'm reviewing it. <laughs> but that's the case here. And unfortunately, like this past week. Wait, you don't know when you're reviewing? What? I don't, yeah, because I got a lot of stuff to review, so I don't know when I'm reviewing certain things. These go on them directly, but I'm just going to put it away for now. And, uh, yeah, but this is looking great, and, uh, I'm actually really excited about this one. I've always dug Edeon's design. Um, it's interesting. It's kind of Gundam-esque in a way, a little bit, but, like, more simplified, I feel like. Right? A little bit? Wait. What? He's a little bit Gundamish, no? Um, kind of. First when you got him, I got him, he was a Gundam. There you go, see? So, uh, really glad to have gotten this because, um, I haven't been able to acquire it. It was one of those things that I had, um, passed on last year because... It was coming out during the time when I wasn't buying anything for four months or pre-ordering anything. So I had to let it go, and ever since, I've been looking to get it, looking for deals, but there hasn't really been any. So this guy, you know, I had to get something. I wasn't going to go to the Tamashi shop and not come home with something, and they had him, and I was just like, that's it, just getting it, and there you go. Next up, we got two auction wins from kaiju live my pals at kaiju live i won a couple of things and on their last auction show which i'm really happy about because i hadn't been on the show in a bit and um you know good to come back and jump right into things um but i you know like i do always check out what and you can check out my facebook page because i usually post links to when they do auction shows, or you could just check out their Facebook page as well because they always post their own links. Um, but, you know, like, when I saw these, and what we got here is uh, the X Plus Baby Iris and uh, Burning Gamera, I guess, for lack Why of a better term. Why? Because he's all, like, orange and it's going up his arm and stuff, so. Mm. I guess Burning Gamera? And there's a big glare on my thing. It's just a setup right here that I have right now. I could turn it like this, but then it gets a little darker. Uh, my apologies. But um, these, I'm a sucker for these old X Plus like carded figures. What's that, mean? uh, that means they're on the card here. See, this is a card, card backed. So is X Plus up 
Yeah, it does. So I was really interested in getting them. Um, and, uh, oh. you know, I, I was able to win these. What's this? What's this? Just the, the back, and it shows different characters from the Gamera movies. I guess they, they did figures of all of them. Wait, what's this? That's Iris when it gets bigger. See, that's baby Iris. That's Iris when it gets bigger. You remember um, that? Is this regular Iris? Yep. Regular? Yeah, when it gets big. Is his, that's his, is this his normal form? Yep. Oh. Yep. Whoa. Uh, but really fun to, to, to get these. Uh, I'm not going to open these two up quite yet because then I got to, it's not worth it because I'm going to need my hair dryer to pop everything into place. Um, make everything squishy soft. But they do look amazing. And um, shout out to your boy Shamoy and realist goji fan because um uh they were my two opponents on these and um thanks for <laughs> thanks for bowing out so i could win these <laughs> um i really do appreciate it um that was very nice of you guys and uh I i'm you know i'm glad i'm happy with the prices i paid on them um so you know i mean they weren't cheap but you know, comparatively to prices I've seen, they're comparable. So, you know, this, this stuff is always up and down. But in the heat of the moment, I'm happy with the prices I got them for. And I'll leave it at that. But very, very cool. Definitely stuff I want to review soonish. I At the very least, take them out soon so I could mess around with them. Um, and so do pay attention to my Instagram when I do that. I will post pics. So, yeah, very cool. And shout out to uh, Kaiju Live for getting this out to me really securely and nicely packed. On the same day that Kaiju Live, uh, the Kaiju Live box came, uh, which came in a, uh, was shipped in a diamond box. An actual box from Diamond came um, of s new stuff to review. Shout out to uh, DST for sending over this huge box of stuff. Wow. Right, we already did a unboxing of it, so I'm just gonna go over everything quickly. But um, I, I, I had to include it here because it's part of this week's haul, and starting with the Marvel Select Mighty Thor, which is looking really good. Yeah. I do like that a, a lot. And then we got the whole Tron series that they did with Tron and uh, Inter Infiltrator Flynn and uh, Sark. So pretty cool. What's different from all of them? What's different? What do you mean? It's different from them. What do they do that's different? Uh, I don't know. I'm going to have to open them and find out. Oh. Uh, but I did review the Walgreens version of Flynn, which was the regular blue one. That was the only one of the Trons that I did review from them, but not completely true because I did review the Kingdom Hearts ones as well. So I'm a big Tron fan. So this was awesome. Um, at the time when these came what out originally, Tron? I, I, what's that? What is Tron? It's a movie. We've never watched Tron. No. We're going to have to correct that. I did not realize that. Uh, <laughs> but at the time when these came out last year, this is this is a funny story or side story. I had just gotten a huge amount of stuff from Wait, DST as well. Is there more um more um, what? People in Tron? Yeah, yeah, of course. Who like who? Like I don't know, different characters. Oh, like other characters from other things? Yeah. No, no, that's in Kingdom Hearts. Some of the Tron characters appears in Kingdom Hearts in the game, you know? Uh -huh. Um but, at the time when I when these came out last year, I forgot that they were about to drop, and I got, like, a ton of stuff from DST, kind of like I did here. Um, so, I didn't, like, even though I had asked for them, I didn't, I usually send a follow-up. I didn't follow up at that point, because I just had so much to review, um, that I just didn't want to just make the pile bigger at that point. But I'm really glad to get them now. I will review them. I think these three are gonna be maybe one long review together. I think that's the best way to go, uh, just because it, they've been out for a while, and um, it might be good to just do that. 
but the last two things are brand new and I'm really excited about them. Um, the Crow and Jack Sparrow from Pirates of the Caribbean both look really, really good, guys. I'm really, I was a huge fan of the Crow uh, movie and I've been a fan of the Pirates of the Caribbean stuff. So, and I don't have figures of either one of them. Um, so this is a very cool to get. Um, the Crow was amongst the things I was hoping to get because, you know, uh, full disclosure, once again, just to let you know the story, um, I had asked for the Hulk, and I forgot to say this, but like Spider-Man as well, the new ones, and they were, were out of all of them, but they said, hey, we have all this other stuff, you know, let us know if you want to review anything, and I said... You know, whatever you send, I will review. I have no problem. I love, I, I, you guys know, I love a lot of different things and I love reviewing different things. So I'm really happy, but I really wanted this crow figure. So I'm very, very happy with all of this. Um, and the funny story is that just like Tron last year, the Lord of the Rings stuff just dropped this week <laughs> in stores. And that was one, the, I was I was asking to review that as well a while back, and uh, at this point I might not because I already have six figures here from them to review, and I I I just don't want to push it. Uh, but if you watch this DSD and you want to send me those Lord of the Ring figures anyway, <laughs> that's cool. I'm probably just not gonna follow up for a while until I get through all of this stuff. Next up, the shout outs continue because got to shout out my pal Steven of Steven's Toy Reviews for getting this Super Shredder Shadow Master figure from uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2, The Secret of the this Ooze. Is Nickelodeon there. What's that? Nickelodeon. Nickelodeon, yeah, it does. <laughs> um, Why? From NECA because Nickelodeon owns Turtles. Oh. Um, turtles? That's right. Yeah. And it's looking really, really good. I do uh, I like it. Should we should we take this out? It's been a while. Yeah, um, maybe, I don't know. And a little story time about this. Um, this, Steven actually found this like really quick after they dropped. Uh, yeah, so he's actually had this for well, well over a month. Uh, but I had told him to just hold off because... I just got it this week. Um, I'm not going to take him out of the tray, but just to get a better look. It looks really good, guys. Um, but I had told him to hold off because the Playmates GVK stuff was about to drop. And I didn't know if I was going to be able to find any. So, and you know, figured since he was, you know, he found this already and um, he was going to be looking for, for the GVK stuff. That he would just hold off if he found some. If he found some, uh, that would have been great. Turns out I found them before him. Um, so, um, all good there. And then, you know, we were just waiting just to see, just in case any... Because there was a couple of those missing GVK figures. So, once we figured out that they're probably not coming out right now... Wait, can you take his mask off? I don't think so. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, you know, we decided, finally, let's, let's get this guy shipped. And he looks awesome. Shipped. shipped. What does it mean? It means um, sent, like mailed in the boxes, like when the delivery guys come. Like give him, like give somebody something. Right. Yeah. When you send something to somebody. So I'm seeing that his arms are in a weird, funny angle here. So hopefully, nothing's crazy there. Probably is gonna need some heat, but it is looking fantastic. I skipped out on the first one. Um, mostly because, honestly, uh, Secret of the Ooze wasn't my favorite Turtles movie, so I haven't really been getting anything from that, but, uh, I love the design of Super Shredder, so I, you know, once they said they were doing the second version, I was like, okay, okay, yeah. Alright, that ended abruptly, because, uh, ran out of storage, but I said everything I had to say, and moving on, we got a big thing here. Yeah. That is, uh, the Digimon Adventures Omega Mon or Omnimon, uh, yeah, however you want to say that. I was telling you about that later. Yeah. Um. Right? Uh, recently. And um, this is a Ichibansho figure from Bandai. 
which is like a prize figure in Japan, but Bluefin does bring these guys over. I got this on Amazon because I had Amazon points and I was looking for, you know, something to use them on. And I'm like, oh, I forgot about this guy. I did want to check this out um, because I do like Digimon stuff. I do. Um, the designs are fantastic. And I am going to take a look at this because I've been very curious to see how it looks and uh my brief experiences with the ichibancho line are pretty good like these are just statues buddy they don't really Statue? yeah they don't really move oh how is this ah there we go okay. couldn't figure out how that opened but this looks like to be one of the top prizes because it has a handle that's usually what that signifies Shout out to Steven again <laughs> for confirming that for me. How is this put the Oh, jeez. I should have opened it from the bottom, I guess. Why? Because everything is like tied up crazy here. But, oh well. Doing it anyway. Here, bud, can you take this box? Put it on the floor on the other side of you? No, it's just a box. Yeah. Ooh, we gotta put it together. Wait, 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 no? Can this box? Yeah. And I'm not gonna do that now, so, uh, you yeah, know, we'll just look at it through the plastic. It looks like a good size figure. Sword. It's looking nice. That looks cool. It does. And this is my third. I love this guy. Uh, this is my third. Yeah, he does. Wow, no. wow, this is looking amazing. So, this is funny because I've collected some Digimon stuff over the years here on Ultrazilla, but have never, ever, you know, featured them in a review. Um, this, I guess, will be the first, and then I might go backwards and review some of this stuff because it is just so, so cool. And this is not the only Digimon thing we're going to look at right now, but... I'm not going to put this together right now, but, um, wow, this is amazing. Yeah. All right, so while I'll need a little heat to get everything fitted properly, I put it together just to show you guys. It is gorgeous. It needs a little stand for the cape because the cape is really heavy and it's flowing back. But how awesome does this look? Wow, this is amazing. All right, speaking of J Digimon, I got this big huge machine Dramon kit from uh the figurized standard amplified line Wait, from bandai that? this is machine Dramon. who's machine Dramon? he is this amazing big beast i'll show you i'll show you videos of him he is awesome that's what that looks like um it is a model kit so i'm not gonna go crazy but um this I got at HLJ, Wait, uh, so we're getting into my... Mecha No, Machine Dramon. Uh, machine Dramon. Uh-huh, but I like Mecha Gmon. Dramon. <laughs> Mecha Dramon. Um, so, uh, I don't know when I'm building this, but hopefully soon, because I'm really, oh, really today. curious. Today? No, I can't do it today. Oh, uh, we still could. Maybe this weekend, I don't know. Maybe we'll see. we could do it. Maybe, maybe. Maybe if I... <laughs> Maybe I could build on my own and you're not going to help me while you're sleeping. I could, I could build it. All right, good luck with that. <laughs> um, this looks amazing, um, but it was pri a little bit pricey for a kit. And um, this made my HLJ order, which the rest is just vinyls. The shipping uh, was a little bit outrageous because of that um giant giant thing and now i've had i'm having some i'm letting you guys know but there's gonna be a separate video on this possibly this weekend talking about ordering stuff from everywhere i've been meaning to do uh, something like that where it's kind of like a buyer's guide but kind of also uh, a commentary on uh some of my own personal issues that i've had with getting stuff shipped from Japan lately, so um, be on the lookout for that. I do, um, 
want to do that. And uh, I'm just going to say, you know, I know there's a lot of stuff out right now in Japan. You um, opened that? Uh, this, this is something different than I've gotten before. Um, there's a lot of stuff, you know, a lot of vinyls, you know, mm -hmm. uh, movie monster series stuff and whatnot. Um, and I don't have them all yet. I do have another order coming next week from Amazon Japan that ha has a lot of missing stuff. I will talk about it more in that separate video. But for now, let's just talk about what we do have. And uh, I grabbed this uh, Zenkaiser, Zenkaiser uh, vinyl because it was cheap. And it was actually even cheaper because it was part of uh, HLJ's l latest sale. I haven't gotten a vinyl like this, a Sentai, you know, Ranger vinyl like this in a while. Wait, what? And, what? Um, you know, I just, I really like this one. <laughs> Ultrazilla Jr. was making a clicking sound what? with this. Hey, it wasn't with that. It was like with his beak. It was a beak. Okay, it was like in the corner. I was like, what is that? Yeah. <laughs> but um, this this does look pretty cool. Ultrazilla Jr., you want this one? Mm. You want this guy? I want the one that has his kind of can move more. Oh, okay. Fine. But... I, I decided to pick it up anyway because I'm, we've been really, really, really into it. Um, next up, we got... Ultra Super Monster Series. Right. Uh, Ultra Monster Series. Uh, Death Facer. Oh. Wait, why is he called Death Facer? Because he's got a Death Facer. Oh. Wait, what? Yeah, I don't know. It doesn't look like um, that. This looks really cool. This is, you know, their small line of figures that I've... You know, reviewed plenty of, but I am what thinking do? I'm done with this line does he after. Have a power? Does he have a power? Yeah, he has a power. Uh, I can't remember right now, but you know, we'll look at it. Um, I'm getting my last few of these. You know, uh, one is coming from HLJ. I mean, from Amazon Japan, like I said. And then um, uh, the last one I think I'm gonna get comes out next month. Uh, and then I think I'm just going to take a hiatus from this line. Um, you know, I just can't get everything. And these guys are cool, these little guys. But I don't know. I think I'm going to stop getting them, bud. Wait, what? I'm going to stop getting these. What? These, the little ultras. Unless you really want them. Wait, what? These little Ultraman guys. That, Ultra monsters. That, that move like that? Yeah. These guys. You, you have so many of them. Do you still want me to get them? I want to, for you to get some. Okay, so maybe we'll still get them. I don't know. Um, we'll have to discuss. But I was thinking about stopping on those. Um, but I will always still get the bigger ones. Oh, I'll just the Junior's Ooh. eyes lit up just now. <laughs> and this is uh, King something... I don't know king if he's, Caesar? No, like King of the Monsters type of deal. There's a king and a queen. Uh, the queen is in my Amazon box. Again, we'll talk about Wait, that. The queen what? The, this is the king and there's a queen. What? Yeah. The um, queen what? I don't know. Monster King. Uh, monster. Looks pretty awesome. Bigger Wait, size. These are the ones I really like. Here? Yep. Yep, he does. So this looks gorgeous. Very beautiful looking figure. So, definitely glad uh, to get that. And then, uh, the final thing from HLJ <gasps> is Gauss. Yay! So, this is Movie Monster Series Gauss. Mm. Um, and it does look neat. Um, it looks awesome. Kind of. Kind of. There's some things I'm not too sure about, but uh, kind of. Uh, we'll talk about it. <laughs> uh, I got to still like review. red claws? Yeah, something like that. Um, of course, Legion came out, and, um, I don't have that. But, again, not gonna, not gonna air that out right yet. We're gonna, we're gonna talk about it, guys. We're gonna talk about what's going on. Uh, really but, awesome. yeah, it does. So that was my HLJ haul, these five items, which is cool. And we're just gonna keep it right here, because we got one thing left. And that's this guy. And yes, oh. just this guy. Just this guy. This is the Movie Monster Series. 
Goji Ban. Goji Ban. <laughs> Ultra Zilla Junior likes. <laughs> um, uh, Godzilla Kun. Who's that? This guy. And okay. yeah, and um, yes, there is little. No, yes, it, there it, is it's Minya. Called go Go Bo Go Goji. Go Go Goji Ban. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, absolutely right. Why do you keep forgetting the I don't know. I always forget that. You're right. <laughs> um, and this also came from Amazon Japan. Again, there's a story, but I'm not going to tell it here. Um, but yes, everything here, everything has been split up. And Wait, what's like split up mean? Means like while everything came out at the same time, I've had to split my order through different people and the why uh, the different stores and the reason why this one. You know, came first is um, you know again a story that I'm gonna hold off on telling because I it is part of a bigger, uh, more lengthier subject, and I do want to just keep it on its own. But I do got this guy, and uh, I will be reviewing this and Gauss uh, before anything else here for sure, and then we'll uh, we'll go from there. But that is the haul. You know, lots of stuff to do. Of course, all the Hall DSD stuff. Um, I do want to get Hall that out. Of what? what? Hall of what? Hall of the week. Hall of the week. Yeah. Wait, week. The, this past week, all of this stuff, except past for Ideon, came uh, Wait, this past Ide week. Who is it? Ideon is the, the the red guy back there. The first thing we opened. So lots of cool stuff. Um, yeah, I can't fit it all here, but we're just gonna keep it on these guys. And I do thank you guys for uh, watching this one. Hope you dug it. Let me know your thoughts below. Let me know what you want to see me review first. You know, besides this stuff, besides the DSD stuff. The DSD stuff, again, I'm going to probably try to get moving on uh, quicker because um, the kind folks at DSD sent me all that stuff to, to review. So I want to get it out for them as quick as possible. Um, and uh, But we got some kaiju here to review and a bunch of other awesome stuff. And as well as a lot of awesome stuff that I've gotten prior. Um, so plenty, plenty to do. Hope you dug it. Let me know your thoughts below. I think I said all this. Till next time. Peace out, peeps.